Hello and welcome back to All About Community. Again, my name is Robert L. Harris, and my guest is Guy Bryant. Guy is a local attorney right here in the city of Oakland. Actually, he is my neighbor. He's a good neighbor. <laughs> uh, he's also the legal redress uh, chair and general counsel to the NAACP. Uh, Guy, uh, are there any open, chapter? <laughs> <laughs> open branch? <laughs> uh, matter of fact, uh, we may have to get you for the general counsel of the whole NAACP. <laughs> but uh, any particular uh, issues that you will be dealing with or would like to deal with as the uh, Head of the Legal Redress Committee. Well, we've been working on several pieces of legislation, and I think one of the most important pieces of legislation that I want to bring to your audience is, uh, it used to be AB 273, it's going to probably be changed, but that's Assembly Bill, uh, but it's basically about dyslexia. And um, the oh, reason yeah. dyslexia is important is that over, we know through data that 20% of the population has dyslexia. But when we look at studies and we see that um, when you go to, whether it's the te Texas prison institution or even San Quentin, when you have over 50% or up to 50% of their inmates testing positive for having dyslexia or some other uh, level of, of dysfunction as far as their cognitive reading abilities, you know that there's a clear connection between this dyslexia and criminality. Um, and, and what it ties to is that, amazingly, dyslexia, if it's treated and, and uh, identified in elementary school, it can be resolved in eight to t 10 weeks. And the NAACP has been, I remember uh, a couple of years ago, I guess it was, they uh, signed on to uh, legislation. Right. Now, I know that our time is running out. Could you look into that camera and tell our viewers why it is so important for them to be members of the NAACP. All right, well, hey, uh, strength is in numbers. And uh, the NAACP uh, is moving forward and is advocating for the interests of all Americans, and particularly Americans of color. Um, we really do need your input. We need to know what's important to you. Um, we're on the verge in America of changing um, a, a major shift is happening. We're seeing that labor alone is no longer enough to be able to afford to be in America. You can work two jobs. You can have your spouse work two jobs. And still, how are you going to cover a $400,000, $500,000 mortgage? How are you still going to pay thirty dollars to $40,000 a year for your child to go to college? How are you going to cover a car note? Even a used car now is averaging roughly 30000 It's becoming extremely difficult to have the American dream in the current and, environment. And we want to make certain that the American dream is preserved. And one of the ways you can do that is become a member of the NAACP. Unfortunately, we are out of time. But stay tuned because our next guest will be Chadwick Spell, who is the new chair of the Oakland African American Chamber of Commerce. Uh, Guy Bryant, we want to thank you for being our guest today. Thank you very much. And <clears throat> please remember, become a member of the Oakland branch of the NAACP. We will be right back with our next segment. Thank you for joining us.